The nature of the child has changed radically over the last hundred or so years. It used to be an agrarian society where a child was a producer for the family, where it was essential for a man and a woman to become a unit and run the farm or run the business or what have you. Now, children have become a major expense to the point where even your educated but not super rich people have one child. How much of the difference between the perception of marriage by the society back then when it was essential and the children were a boom to now when, hey, I don't really have to get married. There are all those chicks out there and kids are expensive. <laughs> Your thoughts on it? So, um, you know, look, the day, the, all of the survey evidence suggests that people are still, they still like the idea of marriage and they still like the idea of children. I was just looking at a um, recent survey from uh, Pew Center for Research um, interviewing this millennial group, the people in their 20s and early 30s, and you know, still the large, very large majority want these things. So even if it is expensive, even if it's not necessary, and it isn't, uh, uh, people still want it. <coughs> I think, you know, one of the things I've always thought about why Americans in particular are more marriage friendly, more, more you know, still pursue marriage, because in Europe, you know, if you, if there are parts of Europe, if you have this conversation, they'll think, well, what are they even talking <coughs> about? But, um, uh, you know, for one thing, uh, you know, you've just got the basic biological reality. We seem to be, you know, we, we are wired to want to reproduce. I mean, that's just, you're never, you're never going to educate or, or industrialize us, you know, to the point where we're not going to want that. So that's one thing. But the other thing um, uh, that I would add to that is that um, when, well, actually, I'm going to stop there. But I'll, I'll, I'll yeah, add one yeah, thing. Yeah. <laughs> um, I think the, the people are having children, they're just not marrying. So, um, so I would say the desire for children remains extremely strong no matter how much, how expensive. It's usually not something people take into account when they procreate. But, but marriage is not necessarily important to having children for, for a growing number of people.